This is an exclusive House of Ramirez interview. Hey guys, this is House of Ramirez, and I'm here with my sister, Camelia, and we have big announcements going on. She's doing it big, and I'm just excited to bring her onto the show and also bring her product out and let everybody else that's not aware become aware. So Camelia, uh, go ahead and just, you know, just let us know um, a little bit about yourself. Where are you from? I'm originally from Jamaica. That's where my, my family's from. That's where I was born. Um, but I was raised in Washington, D.C. So I went to college out there and then I moved to Los Angeles a little bit after college. And I've been here for almost 14 years now. So it's been a while. So Los Angeles I know, is know that's right. Nice, nice. I love Los Angeles. I, you know, any part you go to, you make friends and you have family, that's home. You know, it's a part of home. So, yeah. Exactly. And I just love, you love the weather here. So it's always an excuse to be outside and just explore. And that's what I love the most about Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. The weather, it's, it's paradise all around. It's always sunny. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> for the most part, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, Camelia, go ahead and just tell us. I went ahead and looked into what you got going on. You have a trivia game, and it's called Brilliant or BS. Can you go ahead and tell us what sparked you to start this trivia? Yeah, well, I am a big fan of trivia. So uh, my friends and my husband, well, before COVID, <laughs> you go to trivia nights, you know, and we go to bars and different places and play trivia. So I've always been kind of like a trivia nerd. Um, so that's one thing. But I also really like bluffing games. So anything where you have to try to like fool your friends or trick the other people or I'm not very good at poker, but any kind of like bluffing games like Fibbage or Balderdash, I really like. And so this was my way of combining two things, trivia and bluffing. So what's great about the games that most people say, oh, I'm not good at trivia. And I tell them, you don't have to be. It's not about, that's not really what it's about. It's about making people think you know the answer. So if you can pretend and bluff your way through it, you can still win the game. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It, it, you know, it's a little bit of everything for everyone. So everybody can tune in and play. You know, you like you said, you don't have to love trivia or be good at it. As long as you want to play, you could go ahead and play your bluff and go ahead and play, <laughs> you know? Yeah, and that's what really I wanted to capture in the game. Like you said, it's for everybody. So you don't have to feel like, oh, I have to be one of those super smart trivia people in order to play the game. You don't really. It's just You just have to talk a good game. <laughs> exactly. And that's what it's all about, you know? You have to be quick on your toes, quick on your feet. Um, but tell me, how does it feel to have a great and awesome and hilarious trivia game that our families, our, our communities are now using to spend time with one another, to come together and laugh and, and you know, just enjoy and embrace each other's um, experience together. So how does that feel? That feels amazing. Honestly, that was the whole intention behind it. You know, I love, I've always loved game nights and playing games with my family and friends growing up. And so the fact that people are getting together and they're creating memories and laughing and having a good time, uh, that's just like the best reward for me is knowing that I came up with something that people are, you know, having a good time playing and they're bring, and it's bringing people together and it's sparking conversation. You know, you get to get away from your computer and get away from the TV, get away from your phones and just play a traditional card game. And that's what's great. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's a beautiful thing. So I just want to encourage you to keep on doing what you're doing. Um, you know, this is a great way, like you mentioned, bringing everyone together. And right now, that's what we need in a world that's steadily focusing on dividing us all. So thank you for that. That's awesome. Okay. Um, I want to ask you. Oh, <laughs> yeah. No, thank you. <laughs> So I want to ask you, you sold out in August. Are we able to buy our family and ourselves a trivia game now? We're looking, what, close to end of November. Are we able to go ahead and purchase? Yes, we are fully restocked on our website, which is brilliantorbs.com and also on Amazon. 
Uh, there are a couple of other retailers that we've partnered with that are online, uh, such as Uncommon Goods and also Knack Shops, which is a, um, a gifting service where you can create your own custom gift boxes to send to people. So yes, we are fully stocked. We were, we were excited to sell out in August and now we're, we're back in just in time for the holidays. Okay, that's great to hear because I was going to say, whoa, sweet baby Jesus. Because, you know, you being uh, featured in Pop Insider of the Year, like, that's big, you know. And I was like, I want a piece of that. You know, I want to know what this, all the hullabaloo is all about, you know. <laughs> so, you know, I'm I'm just very excited and very thankful that you were able to take some time to sit down with me and let us all know uh, the hilarious, amazing trivia game that you have for us all to come together it's amazing so thank you for that um i want to ask you uh, i always do this at the end um house of ramirez is big on shout outs are there any shout outs that you want to make right now yeah, you know what? I want to shout out all of the other Black game creators out there. I've been lucky enough to get into this community, and it's because of people like Black Card Revoked, you know, Cards for All People, Trap Wars, Rhyme Antics. It's because of them that I even thought that I could make my own game. So I just wanted to hopefully this is encouraging other people out there. If you have an idea and you're passionate about it, just go ahead and do it. Yes, yes. I love it. I love it. And that's what it's all about. It's 2020 and we have to support one another. We have to come together as a collective and just encourage one another and support one another. So thank you for that. Thank you. So on social media, uh, we can find you at Brilliant, B-R-I-L-L-I-A-N-T-O-R-B-S. Um, and your website is brilliantorbs.com, correct? That is correct. And this is the game here. You can go ahead and purchase it on Amazon or brilliantorbs.com. Amazing. Well, thank you so much, Camelia. I hope you have an amazing evening. Um, and many blessings to you. Keep your head up high and keep on doing the great, excellent work. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. This was a fun interview and I love your energy and I believe in everything that you guys are doing. So thank you so much. Thank you. Until next time. Bye. Bye. Make sure to follow House of Ramirez on all social media platforms.